Well, hallelujah. I just spent another time in the presence of the Lord, singing and worshiping the Lord. We, uh, we sang a song that we usually sing in church. It's uh, from, from the book of Psalms. It's Psalms 121. And it talks about how we can lift up our eyes to the hills from whence cometh our help. That our help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. And I was thinking, I mean, who else would we, would we want to turn to than the one who made it all? So if you're having any struggles or difficulties today, I just encourage you to turn to the one who made it all. And, um, and he has the answer and the solution to whatever you're going through. There's an old song that, uh, you remember, it put your hand in the hand of the man who stilled the waters. Put your hand in the hand of the man who walked the sea, the one from Galilee. You know, just put your hand in his hand and uh, everything's going to be all right. And uh, so are you excited about springtime? I hope you are because woohoo! I have a couple uh, Sherry's here and I have a friend Matt here in the room with me and and uh, we're excited about spring and summer and talking about canoe trips and planning some events down Gunpowder State Park and and uh, just getting people together there isn't anything like hanging around uh, brothers and sisters just having a good time hanging out with the family enjoying creation so I just want to encourage you this is going to be a great year for you uh, start thinking about things you can do uh, to be a blessing to other people. So I'm going to pray for uh, pray for you in that area. Lord, thank you for this day. Thank you for what you're doing in our lives. Thank you for the plans that we can be talking about. We can, bend, we can begin to talk about going out on bike rides and canoe trips and, and uh, hanging out at the, the park, uh, just spending time with one another, with family. I pray, Lord, that you'll just put these dreams, these visions, and these desires, Lord, within each one of our hearts. So that we'll not just be so wrapped up in work and the day-by-day -day routine that we uh, that we forget. There's so many exciting things that we can be planning on doing. So uh, just birth those things in the hearts of your people today. And uh, we'll give you the praise in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, go and uh, be a blessing today and start thinking about all the exciting ways you can enjoy God and His creation and His people. Amen. God bless you all.